Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here back in EU4, playing as, not Siak, but the Ottomans. So last time we were struggling a little bit, but we finally managed to get a few colonies down here. Well, we have one province under us, and we have already turned this into, I think, yeah, part of a trade, or Turkish Indonesia company. Cool. Um, I guess we also could, we've already built a broker's exchange. In which now, garrison company, defensiveness, harbor, local trade power, actually might not be bad to do. Uh, let's see. Malacca. We probably have like, no trade power here. Um, as a trade company, so do the Portuguese, which we will take them out eventually, hopefully. Spain is even down here too, maybe. Huh. Malacca. Uh, yeah, we're not even we're not even big enough to be here. So, but we're going to focus a lot on this region of the world because I want to colonize. But right now, we're currently at war with Yemen and all those folks down here. So we've got to take them out. Aswan is ours. Very good. Actually, how many people do we have under us, or how many people do we have in terms of relations? Five out of five. We need to annex somebody next. Uh, Gazakumuk is who we got to annex next after this war is over. So. Uh, sure. Syrian heritage. Very cool. Very cool. Alright. Alright. Oh, there we go. Arbil is now of our faith. And now we can do that one next. Very good. Ah, Kahira. Nice. Batum. Good. They're going to go that way. We got this one done. Oh. Muscovy. Yeah, we got to keep an eye out for Muscovy. And... Oh, wait. Hold on. Is that normal? Did Austria actually lose something here? Maybe not. End with Poland? No, maybe not. I don't know, maybe. I, I can't tell at this point. I've been spending, spending so much time away from Europe that I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> so, Age of Reformation is ending. That's nice. You guys come here. Good, good, good. And there. Thank you. And we gotta be prepared for these armies down here. Uh, yes. Peasants War, very cool. Mamlux. Oh, good luck with that. You are gonna be slaughtered so harshly. You know what? Follow them. Don't let them move around that much. Oh, we cut him off. Those guys will be good. They're still moving. Nigard challenged. Um, uh, who's a consort right now? Uh, she's already pretty good. Uh, well, she's more balanced than anyone else. Cool. Actually, just get up there as fast as you can. I guess that's the fastest way. You guys come right here. That'd be nice. Keep them in place until we get the other army up there. And they all died. Well, they didn't all die. Close enough, though. Alright, so I'm going to take some Yemeni territory. And we will have to beat up Ethiopia eventually. Which is fine with me. We will get there. We shall do it. Ah, good. Another colony. So that's worth about three. If I were to do this, yes. It's probably still worth three. Cool. Um, build buildings. Oh, we can build normal buildings here too. That's kind of nice. <clears throat> hmm. I would have this as a trade company in the Indo Indonesian island. That's kind of good. Local tax modifier, governance. Governance is okay. Local production efficiency. Well, what are we? How much are we producing? Not a bunch. Eh. How much is that? Four hundred. That's quite a bit, but we can afford it. Nice. And wow, look at Tunis. So there's a couple comments I do want to get to, such as why the enemy army was so fast around here in the last episode. That is because apparently they had more speed pips than me. So, it's good to keep that in mind, about how many speed pips that they have. Let's go ahead and build up a university here, because I think that'd be pretty good. 
That seems like a smart thing to do to build a university in your capital. Questions of rights? Kadif? Uh, we'll do that for now. Oh yeah, you guys are our vassals too, which is kind of nice. Cool. And another one is play as Austria someday. After once we're done with this campaign, just to try them out and to learn the mechanics of the HRE. Which actually sounds like a really good idea. So, ooh, advisor cost goes down. Oh yeah, that's pretty nice. Someone still has high liberty to desire. Nigar challenged. Nope. Well, we got that one. That's kind of nice. Uh, YD Halfa. Cool. Can't get down there. That's fine. Well, we'll wait. It's almost done. There you go. There we go. You guys can go that way. You guys can go that way. You guys can go that way. And you guys come down there. Beautiful. Makoria. We already. Ha I don't want too many vassals. What can we do here? Diplomatic ideas. We're still ahead of time, so I don't feel bad about doing that. And I will probably unlock a military idea next. Naval force I mean, Is it really worth it? Fabricate claims in overseas colonial regions actually is probably going to be worth it because of about what I'm going to do to do to Spain. Because that's another comment. Tag team Spain again with France. So, and if I, you play this right, you can, like, get four colonies off Spain, like in the New World, slowly convert them, core them, convert their culture to our culture, then take another province and then make that a new uh, colony under us, which actually sounds like a really good idea. So, I'm going to try to do that probably in the 7th, well, we're, we already are in the 17th century, but as time goes on. No, no. I definitely do not want them to get military access. I want that region. <sighs> Turn you guys back up this way. Good. Nope. Yeah, come there. That's good. That's pretty good. No. Now beat him up. Nice. And now we're getting beaten up. But we won, regardless. Beautiful. Where'd they go? Aust of course, Austria wants to go to war with Poland. Oh, they still have some rebels. And eh, just some peasants, though. Cossack aggression. So be it. Uh, Muscovite response. Good. Good. Ottomans, very nice, very nice. I'm going to need another army here, just because we're stretched out so far between these different continents that we're on. Come on, don't lose, good. Nice. So, who, are we fighting Tunis? We are fighting Tunis. Rebel, rebel stuff, rebels, and... Nice. Oh, those are just our galleys. They're uh, light ships. Light ships. Who owns this? Is this Oman? No, the Sind. Oh, I've got to beat up Sind then, I guess. Nice. Good stuff. The reins are too loose. Five years of separatism in Qatar. Eh, you can lose that. That's fine. I don't really care about that too much. Yeah, you guys are not having a good time. Neither is Spain. Tunisian separatists, huh? Nice. You guys are at war with... Susquehannock. Alright, well, yeah, okay, whatever. Good. Head on over here. Uh, unless there's a... Yep, you can already. And I'll do that one. Nice. It's going to cost us quite a bit of uh, admin points, so... And before we move on... Look at that. That's beautiful. Uh, now, have we... Yeah, we've added both of these guys over to Trade Company. Uh, oh, we want to get up here, too. Coastline would be good to get as well. But, let's have two colonies at once, just because we only have one colonist. They have a severe monsoon, and it's tropical. 
That doesn't sound very good to me. Let's come over here because we do need to get this tile. This I think it's this one right here that we really, really, really need. Someone told me I should puppet them. Maybe I should just annex them. Maybe I should annex them. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe, maybe not. I'm not really sure if I should or not. Mm, give my air. It's probably really risky doing that like this. I'm not sure if I really should puppet Indonesia. I don't think it'd be a good idea to. Um, yeah, I don't think it'd be a good idea to puppet them. Just add them as a trade company. Maybe it is good. Maybe it's good to have them as a puppet. But that, means that requires one diplomatic relation, which isn't really ideal. And, you know, I'm, looking, I'm gonna leave most of Yemen actually in Africa. Just because I wanna take all the peninsula as much as possible. And take that, if we can, no. You know what, if I could take that and cut these guys off from each other, that actually would be kinda nice. Yeah, that actually would be very, 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 very nice. I'm turn that to Ethiopia, because I wanna make Ethiopia just a little bit stronger, because I don't want very strong Yemen. Good enough for me. Good. And we don't have to spend too much admin points there, because we're going to be spending a lot of admin points, oh look at that, uh, for other places. You guys are up there, I'll put you guys up there. Oh man, look at that. Ah, uh, they're actually not doing terrible so far. Could go to war with Austria, but we're going to wait first. What are you guys doing? What the heck is this? Um... How many ships can I have at one time? What's my? F I can have a couple more. It's not bad. You know what? Maybe we'll maybe we'll have a new uh, uh, thing over here. And the other four come down here. You, I would love. Oh, you're Nubian. That's kind of cool. And Catholic. Or not Catholic, but Coptic. That's cool. Oh, good. I could annex them, but that'd be there'd be no point to. Just give me all you got. Nice. The Yemeni Horn of Africa, because my goal is to get rid of all of this and then take this area and take this as well. Pretty much take as much of Africa as possible. Good. Now let's really beat these guys up. Ma'am, Lux, what? No, you don't. You don't need anything. Papal states, keep an eye on all of this, because Poland doesn't look too bad right now. Nope. Jufra. Very good. That's never enough money. Build more buildings, yes, uh, I should probably do that. I want to save this just for a little bit more. Uh, tr oh, that's not maybe bad. We should probably get more workshops. Workshops are important. That's one of our missions, too, actually, so... If you build a bunch of workshops, that's kind of okay with me. There you go. No, I spent way too much money. Just like in real life, right? I spent too much money just like in real life. You guys go right there. Sure. If Austria... I don't think Austria will lose. But if they would... Oh, hold on. Who are they actually fighting? They have... Oh my gosh, they have so many enemies. Poland, Lithuania, yeah. Someone needs to take down Austria. It could be me, but... Mm, taking down Austria, not a great idea. That's pr they're pretty strong. The age of the Koprulus. That seems pretty good. Yeah. Nice. Nope. So they took it, which is fine. Get here before they can come over. Cool. Tunis, what can we do with you? I wish I could vassalize them. That'd be really awesome, but we can't. Um, I really don't want to take too much, like before, just because we're not over here just yet. We're almost over here. But give up claims in the Ottoman territory. Give up claims over there. What, you can't do that? No, you can't do that either. There you go. Deal with your rebels, I don't really care about them. Cool. Head on home. So we can take the rest of the coast, or we can come down here. Uh, it might be better if we just go have a border with Yemen. We get down through here this way. Just so that we can always go to war with them. Through this side as well. That's not too bad of an idea. 
Ah, nice. Very good. Delta. Red Sea Hills. Um, Sucasia? Do we make. Oh, we can make this maybe a state. Probably isn't really worth it. 107, that's not bad. Intrigues. Diplomatic advisor leaves. Preposterous. Cool. And let us go to peace. Uh, or I could go this way, then eventually take out Tunis next time, and get all the way down to Africa this way. It would be faster and cheaper to go this way. Actually, that's probably a good idea. We also want Tabruk, so let's at least take all four of these. Take that. There you go. Now you'll have no connections to the outside world. Beautiful. This is going to kill my admin point, but whatever. There's going to be a lot of aggressive expansion. Now this is looking awesome. Wow. We need to, actually this, this isn't this isn't very high development stuff, so that's good. Makes it nice and cheap for us to get. Oh, I could have just cored all. Whoops. Oh well. Hey, but at least we're at peace. Peace is always nice to have. For now. Yeah, look at Poland again. Yeah, they're just getting smashed. Oh, Poland. Do you have any upgrades for these guys? Just go ahead. Heal up. Lanan. Yes. There you go. That's all you needed. Judge the man. Base production. A new legal heir. 543 is actually really, really good. Any upgrades? Nope. Good. Continue doing to protect trade in Aleppo. And now, where's our other group? There you are. No, no. That's not you. There you are. Nice. Right, super close. Good. A law bringer, huh? Improvements in naval technology. We don't have any... Yeah. Use caution. Good. Protect trade right here. Hmm. If I want to go to war with Spain... We have no castles belli. France would say yes, but Austria and, and Portugal we would have to fight. Yeah, they... Oh, with Austria there, they have a lot of soldiers. Poland, do you feel threatened? But they probably want an alliance. But me, Poland, and France versus Austria would not be a bad idea. Milan, Pap Pope? Oh yeah, we're also peace. Let's go ahead and annex these guys. We just need to straight up annex them now. But, let's see. What can we do about you guys? You guys are a vassal. Oh, you're our vassals. We already took you out before. Oh, wow. Actually, we're a little bit behind in military tech. Oh, that's not good. That's never good. Good, good, good. Oh, whoops. I wanted to click on what was their product. All the product down here. Nice, I'll jolf. Uh, we could attack them. Is it worth always just killing off the natives? They may or may not tolerate our presence. When the colony becomes a city, the remaining natives will give the following benefits. More local goods. Eh, maybe we shouldn't kill them off. Uh, diplomatic attack. You might as well. So now we're going to save up for a lot of admin points to get down there. Uh, the next one, I would love to get uh, expansion. We might... Mm, I, I did say I want to go military. Eventually, I'll say that say like this. Eventually, we'll probably get rid of exploration. But oh my gosh, no! Spain, Spain needs to be taken down. They really need to be taken down, at Notch. But I have no access to getting over there. Uh, where is our navy? All right, so I'll, I'll build you guys up a little bit more. And train. I need my guys to train. Uh, I really don't want to do it like that. Where is this? Click here to sign leader unit. That one right there. That's, I don't want to, I don't want my armies to train if they have the commander or the leader of the country. Ooh, person ability doesn't matter. There you go. Secondism, legalism. Nice. Properly ours. What is our missions like still? Safeguard. Good, 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 good. good. We've done this, have we? Yep. Have we done this? 
<clears throat> We're almost done with this Egyptian mission, which is good. Of course, we need to still need Bosnia, but the Last Crusader Bastion. Oh, yeah, we can take up Ferrero. Who are you guys allied with? France and Austria still. God dang. Wow, Austria. Wow. Um, an alliance with Poland, me, and the Ottomans. Oh, France. I'm the Ottomans. Probably would be pretty good. Yes, because they both hate Austria. Nice. Tabuk. Good. Bohemian Crystal. That's well, that's for you. It's weird. I'm ally actually allied with the Poles. Very weird. Can't do this yet. We have no active estate agenda. But we do. Oh, we need to go to war with these guys by the 23rd. When did I make these ships? Seriously. Oh, oh I mean, that one was already still there, which is fine. Protect trade. And Alexandria? Sure. Seems pretty good. I want to take these guys out as well. They kind of like us. Oh, hold on. They're actually fighting other people. Nice. Range bring fertility to Indonesian islands. Great. Did they just go to war? They might have just gone to war with you. Uzbek. Uz Chagatai? Uzbek. And Kam. Who's Kashmir? Shirvan. Where is Shirvan? Oh, Shirvan's up there. Oh, who cares then? If that's the case, hmm. They might be a little distracted. This is the perfect opportunity to go ahead. Go ahead and move that way. I'm going to call you guys down. As long as we have one... Well, how much money are we making? We're making enough that I think... Uh, fort maintenance it costs about 20. Army maintenance is 46. Oh, man. Army professionalism looking pretty good. How many more units can we have? Oh, we can have quite a bit more. Cool. And Diplotech. Oh, we can't increase this. Oh, the Age of Absolutism. As governments wrest the absolute power in the countries from other parties, they're now able to devote themselves to the building of empires. The Age of State, Rulers, and their armies. Nice. Moldavia. Bro, are you independent? You are, so no wonder you did that. You, ins you insulted us. But, I mean... I don't really care. I've got bigger fish to fry right now, man. Uh, how far are we, are we along with this? Not that far, which is fine. Sure. It's fine, move. 50. Oh boy. No, you're going to become part of us, whether you like it or not. Uh, with that zero, no. We will attack these guys eventually. Brunei and Patani. Good. Go ahead and upgrade the ships. It's fine. And then we will use these guys. Oh, that's six. God dang. No, we, we, maybe we can't. That's pretty darn strong. Not going to lie. That's pretty darn strong. I don't think I can take them out. I'm going to keep those guys down there just in case we have rebels. So that's good for that. You guys. Beef you guys up as well. We have one army over here, which is fine. Having... Well... One, two, three, four, five. Let's get five. One, two. There you go. Ah, oh, Mosul. Very nice. Now, we don't do this because it lowers our absolutism. And let's see. Let's look at that mechanic. We're making a, a great amount of money. No embargoes on us. Transferring power to us. I really want to colonize a lot now. I really do. <laughs> Uh, is there anything else here? Global settlers. Native assimilation? That's not bad. Maximum agricultures. Eh. I don't mind this, but it would cost us one more diplo point, which I don't like. No? Oh, you guys. Just be defensive. Actually, you guys can both consider just sieging down areas. What is this? It's Enable promote investments. A little more inflation. Increases trade power. Is that worth it? That might be worth it, actually. Yeah. Seize lands. I don't want to seize lands. That's just, I don't like that. Wallachia. I love Wallachia. Pay off debt. You know what? I'll pay off your debt. You're a great vassal. How's this work going for him? 
Going pretty well. Cool. We could ally with them. So, Sibir is up here, so they probably won't be able to get to us. Guajarat? Oh, that's pretty big. I don't know. This is, this is pretty big, man. Uh, Jean. Um. Delhi's right there. Nagaur? Mushafa. Yeah, I'm glad we're making another army for this. I don't know who his last war. Hold on, let's look them up. Let's look them up. Jampur is there. Oh, there's Nagwar. Nagwar. And you. Hmm. Oh, there you are. No. Yeah, no. Close enough. I mean, we're fighting India now. Oh, we're taking Golistan. We could do that. Well, we'll see what happens at, at the end of this peace deal. They actually have more soldiers than us. Well, not actually, no, not real. Oh, yeah, they do have a lot more cannons. Head out. Head out. As we make another army up immediately. Hopefully, we can do okay. God, I hope so. We just gotta grab stuff as fast as we can so they, they can't do very much against us. Administrators. Uh, yes, yes. Move, fellas, move. Good. We go up or down. We go right there. Nice. Any more? Nope, that's done. 10,000 infantry. That's probably, honestly, not enough. Uh, protests? Where is that? Let us compensate them? That's fine. We should compensate them. War has changed. Uh, new Merc companies. That's kind of cool. I don't know anything about the UK during this time, but that seems pretty cool. We're probably going to honestly need more things, more soldiers here, especially if we want to conduct some warfare. Most definitely. And since we're here, we could probably go another building on here. We did that. Foreign influence. Local tech. I mean, honestly, 50%, that's completely not worth it. Garrisons, defensive supply, trade steering. That might be actually worth it. Land force limits, naval force limits. Trade value modifier. Ottomans yearly army tradition. Yeah, that sounds like a lot of fun, actually. Let's grab that. No enemy armies yet. Ooh, spices. Oh, I love that. Yeah, my goal is to get down to at least Australia to have us own them. I like that idea. I really like that idea. Aust Ottoman Australia. Good. Good. We found an enemy army, but we can't really get to them. We gotta get BAM! Awesome. Good. What? Where are you going? No, come back! Baby, come back! Good. Uh, oh, there's a castle here. We got to get out. It'd be good to probably throw on more cannons on each one of our armies, just so that we can... Well, how many cannons do we need for these types of forts? Um, it's not bad. It's only level 2. We're already at 42, so... I see a couple more enemy armies. That's not good. Oh, they've reached over here, which is actually kind of okay with me, since we have you guys down here. At least we're somewhat located around here. Oh, boy. They're trying to attack us. So be it. Just in case. Nice. Oh, that is not... Oh, yeah, they were just immediately crushed. Legalism? Yes, please. Very nice. Very nice. Both of you move down this, this way. You probably only need one to do that. Oh, go there to help take him out. If needed, maybe not. Good. And we smash the hell out of him. Great. So far, so good. Sharing is caring. Yes, cabinet cooperation. Hearing is absolutely caring. Now, we're not at war with these guys. Yeah, Sind? Not yet. I will guarantee you we will go to war with them by the end of this campaign. It might be in the next episode, too. I don't know. Let's see what happens. So, like earlier in this campaign, I said I want to unify Islam. That's a really good goal for us. Oh, no. Magnet ro rebels. That's not good. Oh, it's got some Austrian peasant rebels. Good. Now, we can't get down here, but really, we mostly can. Which is nice. Very nice. Very few forts down here. Son. 
sign. So far, we're only 17%, which isn't great. Kill wall, sure. We'll give you that for now until we take you out ourselves. Even though I should really be focused on Africa more, but we can't really reach that area. Oh, wow, look at Benin. That looks pretty bad. I'm sure France would love to go to war with Spain to take some more of their stuff. Good. Oh, take the reinforcements, yes. Just because we can build something doesn't mean we should. Foreign theologians? Oh, do that one, yeah. Nice. Only at 19%. We're getting there. Nice. It's weird that we, as the Ottomans, have to contain the Austrians with... Or kind of contain, or make an alliance against Austria. Me, Bert, Poland, France. It's all them folks. Yeah, I was just, just land grabbing right now. I kind of like it, still. Nice, good job, guys. Keep you guys down there for now. All right, how much money are we making? 61, Jesus, that's so much money. I love it. Iron ore quality problems. Good. Tune, come to Tune. Oh, wait. Why do we have two armies here? Puppet dog. This might spell the end of little Timmy. Maybe. Maybe, I don't know. I almost never play in this region of the world. I almost exclusively play in, like, Europe or Africa or North America or even South America. No guy? No, we're not fighting no guy now. Mm, get some more admin power. Uh, we need to get sieges down as fast as possible. Get the Kiva. Nice. Prince Governor on the Frontier. 335. We already have a pretty good air, don't we? This coffee's pretty good, too. Yeah, 543 is already pretty good. It's good. And this coffee's also pretty good. Wow, we almost get no military power. Wow, that is actually not good. Even though. Yeah, well, we can kind of slack on the military power for now, I suppose. Just because I really want more admin and diplomatic stuff. Come on, guys. Siege them down. Moldavia. The English Civil War for the king. Alright, then. Nigar challenged. No. There you go, invest in new technology. Wow, that's... Is it worth doing that? Is there innovativeness by three? It's not bad. I, I love getting more innovativeness. I do want to colonize this area as fast as possible. Let's take it. I did say I want military ideas, but at this point, we can, we can continue waiting, I think. I think it'd be good just to continue waiting for now. I really want more expansion. I really want more expansion. Center of trade upgrade. Oh, we can upgrade our center of trade? Oh. More diplomatic relations, more colonists. I'm really becoming a colonial nation here. So, even though I love economic. Oh, hold on. We have four slots. We've taken two, two, three. We'd have to take at least one more here, maybe, to get down there. It doesn't mean we're going to stay expansion this entire game. In the end, I might take, switch this out. But I just want more colonists right now, man. I'm sorry. I want to colonize. Royal marriage? Well, that's not good. Oh, are you guys moving? No. Oh, you can. Right there. That's good. Ah, oh, good. We have annexed them. And you guys are over there. You know what? Keep doing that for now. Oh, you got people up there. That's fine. That's impassable, I think. Which is fine. Just keep sieging stuff down for now, then I'll delete that army. Nice. Go straight there. Oh, hello. Those are war elephants. Oh, no. Treachery within the family. Ah, uh, why? Fine. Oh, God. 
I don't like seeing this. This this is kind of scary. Oh boy, war elephants. Uh, where where are these rebels? Okay, that, that's actually pretty good for us. Pretender rebels. Nice. Just don't come to Turkestan, please. Oh no, an artist has passed away. Well, we can afford. Wow, 6.89? Jesus. Yeah. That's... Wow. Wow. Oh boy. No, we lost those guys. It doesn't really matter. I wasn't planning on keeping them anyways. Good. Take those guys down. You guys, head on over here. You guys, pretty much already done. Kabul, is this this is Afghanistan now? God dang, we're moving far and fast. Yes, take down those elephants. At this point, I'll just combine you with someone else. Seriously, man. Don't we have a yeah? There we go. me. There you go. God dang, we're really sneaking Timmy down. Nice. Oh, we lost that. Okay, that makes sense. We're gonna need a lot of admin points for this. Gonna wait for that guy to move over here first. Ottomans. And... Boom. Good. Good. Albania. And... Good. Kish. I wonder how much we can take. We just need at least one province down here in Dagestan. Or Dash is... Dashtistan. We might as well. And actually, before we do that, my puppet has claims. Is it? Is it just that one? Nice, we'll give them that one too. Do they have claims on this? No, that's a little disappointing. Oh, but they claims on this one too. Okay, yeah. That seems pretty good. We'll do that one and we'll do that one. Good. Actually, we'll take some of this too. That's actually going to look really bad. Oh my goodness. You know, we might as well do that. It's not great. We we'll take more of the coast so we can actually get closer to India. And our puppet gets a little more expanded. We can take. Let's take that one too, just so we can destroy the fort. How much is this going to cost me? Timurids will see changing liberty to desire by good. I can take that one. That's as much as we can do, and we can actually connect with our vassal. Yes, yes, so much yes. Wow, I can't believe how far we've gotten into Asia. Holy cow! Wow, Poland's really not looking good. I really don't want to deal with that, so we're not. You guys can be sent over here because we have to take out this nation probably soonish. You guys come down here, deal with whatever happens down here. Uh, Mehmed, Mehmed, you guys come to Egypt proper. Does everyone have an idea where they're going? You don't. You guys stay right there. Actually, stay right there. We're gonna destroy the fort here because it costs quite a bit, and we'll make a mosque. And, so, do you know where you're going? Yes. Yes, you're coming over there. Oh, wow, what the heck is this? That must have been an extra army. Nice. There you go, more loyalty, admin power, that's all it was that we got. Well, I hope we got more admin power, because this is going to cost us a lot. That is not bad. It doesn't look great, but we're working on it. And Tunis is being taken out by more rebels, god dang. Um, yeah, that's pretty good, actually. We still don't have enough manpower. It takes quite a while to get more, more, and more, more. But that's okay. Hmm. Austria's allied with oh, so many people. Lorraine, Burgundy, Netherlands, and Nova Hollandia. Interesting. Muscovy's threatening our trade. You know, whatever. That's pretty normal. You guys. Hunt pirates here. Technology costs. Yeah, let's do that one. That seems kind of nice. Do that. Good. 
Y'all need a leader. Like the, oh, yeah, I guess for now that's fine. You guys can go ahead and train. Trust your neighbor. Uh, when is it truce with the Mamluks going to expire in 23? So it's like more than 10 years. It's almost a little less than 10 years. A little less than 10 years. War games. Uh, more army professionalism. Fine. So be it. We're still making 45 a month. And we shall end this episode building a few more things. Such as a manufactory in where? And we'll build three. Cool. Hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I will see you all tomorrow as we shall continue expanding into Africa, Asia, and Indonesia. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.